This is probably the most advanced modular construction assembly line I've seen in China so far. I heard that this upper and lower level design layout, along with the three-dimensional transportation systems at both ends, is something I had only previously seen at a PPVC factory in Singapore. I came to this factory on its opening day. The second floor is dedicated to the processing and assembly of steel frameworks, while the first floor handles sheet metal stamping, spraying, inspection, and interior fitting processes. This assembly line features a well-planned workflow design and clear workstation divisions, from the processing of top plates, bottom plates, and side walls to assembling the six panels into the main framework. Each step has its designated workstation, organized according to the production process. Additionally, to achieve higher production precision and greater capacity, they've equipped the line with several automated devices to assist manual labor. In an industry as fiercely competitive as this, why would they invest so heavily in building a new modular construction factory? In short, it's about trading capacity for price. Their strategic direction is very clear. Focus solely on OEM original equipment manufacturing. Currently, modular construction factories face a common pain point. When there's work, they can't keep up with demand. But when there's no work, the factory becomes a burden. Modular construction factories must go through the entire process, from main structure to interior fitting, and then wait for delivery. A module typically sits in the factory for over a month. When there are projects, a large factory space is needed to meet production and storage demands. But when projects are completed and there are no continuous orders, the factory becomes a liability. To address this, they established an OEM factory. Any company with orders can manufacture here, eliminating the need for them to take on their own orders or handle design, which saves a significant portion of labor costs. As long as the price is low and the quality is high, they can secure continuous orders from different factories, keeping the facility running nonstop and spreading out costs. The advantages of this model are obvious, but to succeed, it relies heavily on extensive production experience and strong management capabilities. You have to cater to a hundred different clients and make every dish delicious, so you need to master standards like Chinese, American, European, and Australian codes. Different countries, regions, or even project types have varying requirements for the main structure and interior fittings. Therefore, the extent to which a standardized factory production line can perform in OEM is worth considering. Moreover, interior fitting is itself a massive system. The soft power of a modular construction company lies in its ability to manage the interior fitting system's customer service and integrate the supply chain effectively.